BlackRock reporting that Bitcoin and digital asset adoption is growing faster than the internet and mobile phones. So at its recent digital asset conference, BlackRock stated that this is just the beginning while refusing to put a limit on the price of Bitcoin. What do we think? I love BlackRock's approach to all of Bitcoin and cryptocurrency. They basically take everyone else's ideas that the <laughs> crypto community has been using for a long time and they repackage them up into the audience suit and tie type vernacular. And so I can think of an exact chart that came from Raul Paul and I think Global Macro Investor that showed that exact thing like five years ago. And so the beauty is the message has not changed when it comes to Bitcoin or crypto. Now it's just the messenger changed. And because the messenger changed, it is being received better by a whole nother group, which also means that a lot of people in the Bitcoin and crypto community their importance for the marketing of these assets is been significantly diminished compared to Larry Fink and BlackRock. Larry Fink and BlackRock are the most important people in marketing Bitcoin and various cryptocurrencies. If they say something is good, the financial world listens. In a recent update on the Pomp podcast, Anthony Pompliano shared his thoughts on the recent BlackRock report that crypto adoptions is growing at a faster rate than the internet and mobile phones. For Pompliano, having a financial giant like BlackRock buy into Bitcoin is amazing for the industry, as it helps push Bitcoin to a brand new class of potential investors from the traditional investment and financial space. Pompliano highlights how Bitcoiners such as himself and other crypto investors like Raul Pal have been talking about Bitcoin and sharing data showing graphs such as adoption rate for some time. BlackRock is not sharing anything that's new as such, rather they are opening up the crypto market to a much wider audience. Make sure to watch to the end of this video where Pompliano explains why this could be the catalyst for much wider Bitcoin adoption. Also, if you enjoy listening to crypto-related content please show your support by liking and subscribing to this channel by following the link in my bio. And get access to my free daily crypto updates and expert predictions direct to your inbox. Each newsletter contains market intelligence, on-chain data and latest updates from experts in the crypto space. All of this is available completely free of charge. Signing up only takes a moment and you can always change your mind later on. Now back over to Anthony Pompliano. And so what we're watching happen now is these people, which by the way, the team at BlackRock, they're made up of Bitcoiners. They're made up of crypto enthusiasts. Mm -hmm. They know these talking points. They're taking these ideas, which are facts, and they're putting them into presentations with BlackRock's logo on it. And now all of a sudden everyone's like, oh, this isn't some crazy person on the internet saying this. This is BlackRock saying it. And then of course, everyone gets really excited about it. And then they want to allocate to the asset class. And so what we have essentially done is we've memed the messages from the crypto world into traditional finance and the new vessel is BlackRock. Thank you, Larry Fink. And so what we're watching happen now is these people, which by the way, the team at BlackRock, they're made up of Bitcoiners. They're made up of crypto enthusiasts. Mm -hmm. They know these talking points. They're taking these ideas, which are facts, and they're putting them into presentations with BlackRock's logo on it. And now all of a sudden everyone's like, oh, this isn't some crazy person on the internet saying this. This is BlackRock saying it. And then of course, everyone gets really excited about it. And then they want to allocate to the asset class. And so what we have essentially done is we've memed the messages from the crypto world into traditional finance and the new vessel is BlackRock. Thank you, Larry Fink. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe for news and expert predictions direct to your inbox.